Next we're going to look at uh, an exercise that helps us to visualize how an ANOVA works. So if you click on this link it will take you to a Java applet and this represents a one-way between groups ANOVA with four groups and this is uh, like a bar graph or, or an error, error bar graph of the four means for the four groups and we have here the F value which is our inferential test uh, to indicate whether or not there's a significant difference between the groups and F is the ratio between the variance that is due to the between group effect uh, uh, compared to the variance within or inside the groups so at the moment there's no variance due to the grouping factor because there's no difference in the means if we drag this mean up we're starting now to introduce some between group variance and you can see that here relative to the within group variance which is the spread um, within the group we only have a, a very small F value if we drag this up here we're increasing the between group variance and now uh, the F scores getting larger and if we drag another group further away we're further increasing the between group variance and we're um, getting up towards a, an F value of 3. The critical value for F um, is about 3.8 although that depends on the, the degrees of freedom. So one thing we can do to increase F is increase the distance between the means of the groups. The second thing we can do is reduce the within group variance and as we reduce the within group variance this part of the ratio is going down and we're getting a much larger F score. So if you wanted to maximize the F score you would have the means as far apart as possible and you would have the within group variance as small as possible. To minimize the F you would increase the variance within a group and the other thing you could do is make the means equal and if the means are equal there will be a zero uh, F score.